your period blood is actually made up of uterine lining cervical mucus blood vaginal secretions and other things and sometimes they all come out and sometimes it looks like clots and they have different colors and different shades of red hi guys welcome to my youtube channel i am cabello Shoko, and on today's installment of well wise wednesday we are going to be speaking about what different colors of period blood mean so obviously i'm gonna go ahead and start with pink and get it out of the way because in a previous video i spoke about it and what i said in that video is sometimes pink or bright red blood could mean that you have an iron deficiency now while that is true period blood that is pink or bright red is not abnormal if it comes in the first days of your period what is cause for concern is if all throughout your periods say day one to five your blood is coming out pink or bright red that's when it would mean that there's an iron deficiency also if you see bright red blood and it's not supposed to be your period sometimes that just is spotting so spotting is not abnormal either and it's not always a cause for concern because sometimes spotting could just mean hormonal changes in your body say for example during the implantation phase of pregnancy you could see bright red blood so it's also normal if you have an interuterine device the contraceptive the copper contraceptive yeah the iud sometimes after inserting that or implanting that you are told to expect spotting so even then the blood you will see would be bright red or pink but if you are seeing bright red color and it's not during your periods you don't know why it's happening and you're just randomly spotting seek medical advice because yeah sometimes it's a symptom of something relatively serious a color that you are never supposed to see is orange if your period blood comes out as orange do seek medical advice because it could be an indicator of an infection most commonly a bacterial infection so orange is not a color we are supposed to ever see another color that could be indicative of an infection most commonly bacterial vaginosis is a gray color so if you have seen or are seeing your period blood coming out as gray then you need to visit a doctor or seek some other kind of medical intervention number four would be dark red blood but if you look at it from your pad it could look brown or almost black but that just means that you are a little further in your cycle so day five it means because you're not bleeding as heavily and the blood flow is not as high it means the blood has been in your uterus for a while and on your pad it looks that dark because it's been exposed to the elements and it has oxidized and has become really really dark but that's most commonly or in a healthy person that's just because you are on day four or day five and the flow is not as high a color that we want to see would be cranberry red if your blood is coming out and it's that slightly darker shade of red then it denotes a healthy uterus everything's flowing as it should your blood flow your oxygen level your hemoglobin everything is as it should be so that's a happy color that, that's a healthy color and then lastly blood may clot it does most commonly in your period blood it comes out with clots pay close attention to those clots that come out especially if you're seeing them on your pad i mean there it would be easier to inspect so if you're seeing heavier clotting than normal, that's cause to seek a medical intervention. If you're seeing your blood 
too watery that could mean certain deficiencies so see your healthcare provider about that too that's it for today guys thank you so much for staying until the end if there's any color that you've seen that was not covered in the video please comment and then we can engage um please don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like this video don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you're notified every time i upload a new video